Hi guys. So, I've been on this KonMari kick and now I'm finally tackling my winter fall wardrobe. And I broke it up into seasons because I have a whole nother set of clothes for spring and summer that I just can't pull out and do right now. So I'll do a separate video for that. But essentially I'm going to determine my goal, which is obviously to reduce the size of the items in my closet and to also make sure that the things that are in my closet are things that fit, things I love and I just cannot do without, and the rest can be given away or thrown away. Um, next step is gonna be to organize these two wardrobes back here and then um, obviously discarding as well. Also, I forgot to mention that when you do this, you're supposed to take everything out of your closet so you can actually see how much stuff you actually have, which is gonna kind of shock you. Um, and that's what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to shock your system and make you realize that you're actually living with way more than you need. So I'm gonna start by emptying my wardrobe. Um, I'll do my shoes last, but I'm gonna empty my wardrobe onto my bed, and then each item I have to pick up and determine if it sparks joy. Uh, I have these two bins here. This will be trash, and this will be for giveaway. So I'm gonna take you guys on this journey with me. I'm gonna continue discarding and making sure that the things that I keep in my life are things that spark. And with no further ado, check it out. Do you guys see all of this? This is shirts, pants. So now I'm gonna go through everything, pick it up, and determine if I wear it, when's the last time I wore it, um, if I haven't worn it this season, it's probably going to go be donated. Um, does it fit well? Um, is it in good shape? I'm going to consider all of those things. And ultimately, if it were in a bag for a month and I couldn't name what was in that bag, then I don't care about it that much, right? So let's do this. I just got rid of so much stuff and when you look in my closets especially like my shirt closet you may not be able to tell a huge difference but it's huge so let me show you now closet of shirts literally everything in here fits sparks joy I love it and this covers work and just running around the house errands all that so these these are the only winter and fall shirts I have and then these over here are two robes and then like an undershirt. That is pretty freaking good. Wow. Is my pants, skirts, dresses, vests, and cardigans. So aside from, and belts. So aside from this section right here, this is all I have. That's freaking awesome. All these hangers. These are all hangers for the most part that I took off because I gave away or threw away. This pile right here, I'm gonna try on, and I still have to go through my jeans and shoes, so I'm gonna try stuff on from this pile. And then this is the pile I'm keeping, but this pile is going in my spring wardrobe. All right, so now on to jeans and shoes, and trust me, it's gonna get real. Seriously, this is all of my winter and fall shoes, and I'm going to have a hard time getting rid of some of this stuff. Some of it has spring shoes in it, so that'll be good because I won't have to actually get rid of them, but I love shoes. <laughs>
some of shoes. So I kept, these are really worn. Um, so these I get a lot of wear out of. Those are winter boots, like snow boots. Uh, I love these. I forgot I had them. So I'm gonna, I put them at the front so I can make sure I remember. My theory on boots. So long boots, I needed a pair of flat, long brown boots, heeled um, brown boots. Um, these are special and I do get a lot of wear out of these. So I kept those. And then I kept a pair of tall black boots and then these tan boots here that are long. And then these are the booties. And I only kept two pair. And then these moccasins, which are clearly worn, and I've had these for years. So those are the boot collection that I'm keeping. And then here's the heel collection. So I have gray pumps, uh, corally peach pumps, black pumps, standard black pumps, which uh, are really comfy. And then my Bostonians. And then I have trainers back there. Are actually spring shoes. They were just in my closet, so I have to find somewhere for these to go. But all of these will get worn in the spring. And then these are maybes. I love these shoes, but they're a little big and they slip off. So I bought these foot pad things that I'm going to try to see if they work. If not, I'm giving them away. But I love these so much. So now I'm going to go through my blazers, which is a hot mess. Wish me luck. You want to know what's crazy about my blazer situation? This doesn't seem like a lot, but, but technically you need a casual blazer and then a blazer in the primary colors, right? Blue, black, gray. Why do I have so many blazers? So I'm going to try them on and hopefully I can discard some. If they don't fit right, they're gone. And if I prefer one over the other and they're similar, I'll use that one. So I just got rid of, I don't know, three blazers, like four sweaters. I essentially ended up keeping two black blazers. One of them is more like suit-like. The other one is more casual, so I could dress it up or down. Um, nothing alike at all. Um, I kept two gray blazers. One is lightweight, so when I'm traveling to areas that are on the West Coast, I'll wear that one. And then the one's much heavier. So I do a lot of travel to the East Coast, I'll wear that one for there. And then I kept a um, blue blazer that's very specific in style. It's very military-esque. And so I kept that. I am so proud of myself because I love blazers. So um, I'm going to try on all of the stuff that I was unsure about. And then uh, I'm going to show you guys everything that, that I got rid of. Crazy. You guys, this is what I'm left with. I tried on all that, that pile of pants. Um, I ended up getting rid of two more dress pants. Well, as far as jeans go, I have a light pair of jeans that has like paint splatter on them. It was purposeful. So I have those. Then I have this middle grain um, jean that's regular, these darker blue jeans, and then two pairs of black pants. That's it, you guys. Five pairs. Well, actually, and the pants I have on now, which are a little darker. So six pairs of pants, and I had, oh my God, I don't know, 15 or more. Last overview, you guys. I've reduced to this. Shirts, heels, and everydays. And for pants, dresses, blazers, and vests, I've reduced a ton. Long boots, heeled boots, winter boots, and booties. This is progress. You guys, this is all giveaway. Four garbage bags of stuff. Ridiculous. Right, you guys, I'm going to end this video, but I just want you guys to know, KonMari method, it's what's up. I'm going to close this out, and I'm getting ready to film another video of a, a haul of all of my makeup. That's going to you guys. Makeup, nail polish, all that stuff. So keep checking me out. I appreciate you guys. Let me know if you've KonMari'd anything and how it's going, and I'll check you on the next one. Peace.